I'm Dr Marsha Quayle Wright. I'm the Deputy Director for Private Sector Critical National Infrastructure at the NCSC. Cyber UK has been amazing. It's been such a wonderful opportunity to meet people in person, to have conversations with a really diverse range of people. And the plenary sessions and the side sessions have been really amazing. And all of the panels that I've been on have had a really diverse range of people from industry, from government, and we've had some really good conversations about the challenges we're facing at the moment. So my background isn't actually in cybersecurity. I'm a neuroscientist, so I have a PhD in learning how we learn new things. I've spent a long time working in government on resilience, so building resilience to a range of hazards and threats. So everything from counterterrorism to natural disasters to cyber. And actually, most recently, I've moved into this role in the NCSC, which is focused specifically on building resilience to cyber events in the critical national infrastructure sectors. So I think some of the challenges are things that we've spoken about today. So the supply chain, we had a session this morning on how we tackle supply chain issues, how we make sure that our supply chain is resilient and secure. I guess some of the other challenges we're facing are kind of recruitment of people with the right skills, making sure we're getting that kind of diverse range of people into cyber security roles, that we're educating people, you know, giving them the, the skills they need for kind of the jobs of the future. So how to get more women into cybersecurity roles? I think that things like the Cyber First Girls competition are amazing because you're teaching people about what jobs there are available and making them understand that cybersecurity is an option for the future. I think we also have to get people like me, Lindy, the great women that we have working in cyber out talking to people so that they can see that there are people like them having wonderful careers in cyber and that will bring more people in. I think sometimes you need to be able to look up and see people who look like you.